wife, Felika, here for Peak Survival. Today, I'll be talking to you about the app called What Three Words. What inspired me to talk about this today is a good friend of mine who works in emergency services recently had to use this app to locate someone who was in need. Now, because of this app, they were able to respond swiftly and actually save lives. For those of you who don't know what Three Words is, it's a geocode app which has divided the world into 57 trillion grids that are three meters by three meters, creating incredible accuracy as to where you are in the world. Now you can use this app for everyday situations. For instance, if someone who's delivering a parcel can't actually find your address, or if you've parked your car somewhere and you know you may forget the location, or even something more complex like an emergency situation, what three words can definitely help you. Now let's look more into this. The idea was created after one of the founders was actually struggling to get equipment and vans to event locations due to inadequate address information while working as a concert organizer. What three words is a geocode service that is designed to identify any location which has divided the world into 57 trillion squares into encoded geographic locations into three dictionary words, each measuring three meters by three meters or 10 foot by 10 foot, and each having a unique randomly assigned three word address. The encoding is permanently fixed. The what three word algorithm distributes similar sounding three word combinations around the world to enable both human and automated error checking. The result is that if a three word combination is entered slightly incorrectly and the result is still a valid what three word reference, the location will usually be so far away from the user's intended area that the error will be immediately obvious to both a user and an intelligent error checking system. 40,000 English words have been used to cover grids across the sea as well as land the lists have been manually filtered to take account a word length, distinctiveness, frequency, and ease of spelling and pronunciation, and to reduce potential for confusion and even removing offensive words. The addresses are available in 43 languages. So I'm on the app now. The grid I'm standing in, the three by three meter square, is called Examiner Person Adjuster. Press it again now. We have rewriting stamp shop. Solution assures adapt. And I'm actually losing more and more bars the deeper I go. feature on what three words is you can take a photo right here photo mode and you can actually take a photo of this location uh, we'll allow no access so it's determined that that location is called solution assures adapt now continue and it will put a what three word sticker on my image and then I can adjust that. So I can put it here, there, whatnot. So, and then I can share that with friends and family if it's an emergency or even just to meet me at this specific location in the woods. With any technology, having signal is a crucial uh, factor. Um, if you have a smartphone and Android phone, the app works fine. Um, you have to factor as well that you need to have the app, the other user needs to have the app as well. Um, something else that's a bit of a criticism I would say is obviously it's not an open source uh, application and for instance if you uh, communicate these three words but the end user uh, doesn't have a signal and they have access to a map, obviously these three words aren't listed on 
on a normal geographical map. So it becomes a bit redundant. Um, with any situation, if you are in a, a clear emergency and you have signal, obviously call emergency services 999, 911, depending on which country you're in. Um, so if you can, start with that. Um, for you know less emergencies, you can consider using this app. So for those of you who want to be extra cautious, uh, for instance, I'm currently in England. If you want to register your phone with emergency services as an extra backup, the simplest thing to do is you just text 999 and then you write register. I'll do it now. And you'll get a text message. I don't mind Big Brother helping me, especially in an emergency situation. If it's life and death, I'd rather save myself or save a life. So now my phone is officially registered. Uh, again, this is for UK because it's 999, not 911. And I have this as a backup. 